two former housewives. We have Gina Keough, who is a former cast member of Bravo's Real Housewives of Orange County. Also, Mikhail Salaki, former cast member of Bravo's Real Housewives of D.C. First of all, to Gina, uh, I heard you in the background when the attorney for Russell Armstrong said moments ago that so much is made up on these shows because they want the ratings, they want the notoriety, that it's not all real. That's just in the title. Your response to that? It's not scripted. The, these women aren't good enough actors to react something. It's what's going on in their lives. If her husband truly was beating her, and I don't see any proof of it, I've never read anything in the paper about a police report or anything, so that's all hearsay. And at any point, his attorney, Ron, could have called Bravo and say, my husband, uh, my, you know, Russell wishes to be removed from the show, don't show him. As many of our other husbands did, Jim Bellino and everyone, they said, I don't want to be in it. Uh, maybe I'll walk by at a party, but I don't want to be in it. He had that right. At any point, you could quit. So I can't imagine that anything that devastating was coming out on TV that he would have taken his life. Mikhail Salahi, I'm sure it's, yes. do you agree? Can a husband just walk away and say, I'm not going to participate? Or is there an unspoken pressure that if you want your wife on the show, you better be there too? In our city, Jane, uh, it was very different than Gina saying, uh, we were guided, I was guided many times. I was even told a certain line to say one time. So um, in our city it was a little different and each city probably operates different with different production companies for Bravo. Um, in our, so ours was completely different. In my case, my husband was trying to make me happy. I don't know the Armstrongs and I think it's a tragedy and faith is what that family has to hold on to right now. But um, for me, my husband was trying to make me happy and he wasn't like, oh my gosh, reality, you know, we're doing a TV show, but he really wanted to make me happy. And certain family members said absolutely no way they wouldn't be on camera. So. Gina, what about clothes? Did they pay for your clothes, your shoes, your purses, your jewelry? No, but wonderful sky tops. You know, we put those little tops with all the bling on. All the wonderful people in Hollywood would give us clothes and shoes so there really wasn't any cost to us for clothes and shoes and and by the second season people were doing our hair and makeup so no there was no cost that is not a reason that he spent all that money as everybody else in this country Obama sorry made the everybody's business change he wasn't the only tech industry that got hit 50 percent so I don't believe he committed suicide for financial or depression of divorce. I, when you guys get the reports back, I'm sure it's like some freak Prozac or something that made him do it.